Okay, we're uh, here at the ION show in Portland, Oregon, and we are demoing our integration between Spirance Simgen software and AGI's STK. Yeah, I'd like to share with you real quick. In, in uh, STK, we had the ability to actually create these routes very quickly, uh, which makes it easy to drop the different routes in in a validated fashion, allowing for actual flight profiles to be created very quickly. And by creating an STK, uh, in the past, it's only been simulation. And so now we're looking forward to having our users have the capability of taking the simulation and turning it into actual RF uh, by using the Spirant simulator. Okay, and uh, up here you've got the Spirant SimGen software. And as Greg said, the motion trajectory created in STK by this utility can be ported into a SimGen motion file and then you have all the normal SimGen benefits such as being able to uh, run into real hardware, uh, work in both nominal and error type conditions. And this also allows the capability then to uh, play them combined so you actually get the 3D fly through and so you get the real effect of, of flying your simulation in real time uh, in the virtual nature. So you get the virtual live testing in the lab as if you were out in the field actually testing it without all the drawbacks of having to go through frequency clearances, uh, costly air time, um, and now you can actually do it uh, with all those same air conditions and air conditions that you never see in, in real life. Uh, you can play through and have the same test over and over again so you get repeatability uh, in the lab. So what we're showing here today is how a trajectory created in STK uh, can via this new link between SDK and SimGen be ported across to a SimGen scenario. So Greg will just show us SDK. So what we've done in this uh, scenario is we just quickly drag and drop a few points over White Sands missile range and using the actual flight characteristics of a joint strike fighter um, so it's actual validated models of the flight profile. Um, then we can quickly go through the scenario, animate the scenario to see if this is the actual profile we want to fly um, and then have the uh, model uh, exported uh, via an HTML script that can be downloaded directly from our web page. So once the flight profile is built uh, in STK, you just bring up the HTML utility, you select the vehicle that you want to export as a UMT file, time step you want, and you click the create button. It'll bring up a dialog box that allows you to bring in and, and select where you want to put the UMT file. Uh, once you put in the UMT file, just click save. And just like that, then it creates the UMT file that then will port over to SimGen. So here you can see the aircraft in STK banking and turning consistent with the movement in the SimGen scenario. So we've not only got position and velocity, but also attitude, heading, bank and so on. And that allows the antenna effects that you'd see in STK be replicated in the scenario that you're running in SimGen. And the status of this right now is that we have a um, utility that's available for free download from AGI's website. Um, we're interested in customer feedback. Um, we can add in features and enhancements to this as we move forward. We think we've got a good starting point. Um, please give it a try and let us know your feedback. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you.